Right, we're back here. I had a heart attack regarding uh, the file of last episode, but it's all okay. Sort Yay. of. Um. It's not corrupted. Everything's fine. Yeah, more a problem with the, the size of it all, honestly. Yeah. But you know what? It's not corrupted. Yeah. It's always a plus. So, uh, these, uh, ent or I think they're called trance. They, uh, they can pop out of the ground. Hmm. So, this is part of where we're trying to head to? Mm-hmm. We're not actually gonna do that just yet. Um, I think it's this. There we go. We now have a bonfire here. <laughs> I'm actually gonna rest at this one just to make sure that we get, uh, that we get it locked in, you know? Mm -hmm. And we're gonna actually head down this pathway. Okay. <laughs> and we're gonna just cut these guys down. So that gate or that fog gate is not a boss. We still have a ways to go before we reach uh, the boss that I'm aiming for. Mm -hmm. God, I'm so upset right now. I always uh I have a theme song to a cartoon that I haven't watched since like 2015. Stuck in my head and I'm pissed. Oh no. Poor Melon. Also, if you look at these guys, they're very similar to the giant knights uh, in uh, in Ulaseal. Mm -hmm. If you look to your left, you'll see a tree. I mean, you're not wrong. <laughs> There's a lot of trees here. It's too bad. It's too bad like like the captain of a of a flight. Giving like a tour, be like, if you look to your left, fucking trees! <laughs> My god. Yeah. Yeah, it'd be pretty good. <laughs> nah, I'm just gonna cut through these guys because, like I said, uh, we are in an area <laughs> that, uh. Cut. Ha. Huh. Mm. We're in an area that's really easy for us. So, actually, you can see the boss up there. I don't know. How well you can see it through the pixels. Mm. Uh, and we've actually... And we actually have seen these things before. So this is a moonlight butterfly. I like that. Oh, the music for this area is so good. Mm. Isn't it? So unfortunately, this is a fight better suited for ranged people, so we have to... This is a waiting game. <laughs> We are waiting for it to land. Mm -hmm. We've also got an anti-magic shield, so we're good. Nice. Actually, come to think of it, I think if we block and with the ring that we have, we just don't take magic damage for the most part. Unless it's like a really powerful nice. spell. Uh-huh. Mm. So I can just walk back and forth while I wait for this thing to fucking land. Mm -hmm. Honestly, this is a nice change of pace. Yeah. yeah it is. Come the on. music is nice. Yeah. You've heard, you have heard the music before, too. Have I? Yeah, this was used for uh, Gwendolyn as well. Mm, I can't keep track of anything. So, it's gonna land. Three, four, five. That's Moonlight Butterfly. Oh, oh wait, so I think that's wait, what the fuck? Well, wow. yeah, that is a very low level boss, is the thing. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're here after having gone through so many harder challenges. And on top of that, we do have a plus five Quelog Fury Sword. And for humanity to buff it up even further, so... Yeah, the butterfly was never gonna be a problem. <laughs> also, 
Also, you here's cut through it like scissors and paper. Also, here's something a little weird for you guys. This is the exact same model as Andre. Huh. I don't. Watchtower basement key. So I think that's how we would open one of the uh, the towers. Um. Without uh. W without having gone through it first. I think that's I think that's the shortcut through here to get to Havel. Mm. But since I, we took it from the I other direction. <laughs> Why sorry? What's wrong? I can't I can't get past you cutting through this boss like fucking but <laughs> <laughs> Well yeah. I I mean, yeah, it's a it's a hot knife through a butterfly. <laughs> No! <laughs> no! No! no. <laughs> oh, come on. That was good. Uh, it was. That's why I was laughing. But no! <laughs> I was thinking of... I've got an art project. I've, I've got to work on it at some point. Regarding butterflies. Oh, yeah. Why don't you share that with the channel? I was telling Mel a little bit about it. Okay. Uh, so... My... My grandfather passed away recently, um, but uh, among among the many things he left behind are the two ugliest lamps I have ever seen in my entire life. They are uh -huh. these clear plastic. Uh, so basic. So the the body of the lamp are these clear plastic boxes with. Four butterflies and then eat. There, there are two of these lamps. Now, the butterflies are actual butterflies. They're preserved dead butterflies. And, um. So, the lamps are really, really ugly though, and I hate them. And every. and everyone I have talked to fucking hates them. And, uh, so I, but I hated the idea of, like, bringing them to a thrift store or something and then having someone, like, buy them and then when the lamp, you know, when the lamp inevitably stops working, um, I hated thinking that they just get thrown away. Yeah. It's like, that's a waste, because the butterflies are very pretty. Mm -hmm. Um, so I've taken it upon myself to take these lamps apart and, um, put the butterflies in something else. Because it's a waste. They're too pretty for that. would like to point out, while you guys have been talking about this, I have been taking out, essentially, Robin Hood and his Merry Men. Um. Mm -hmm. Because we're about to come up on another yeah, covenant. Yeah, fuck little John. Well? Is it not so? That thou art new, thou fared well to find me. But cometh thee not for the grave of Sir Artorius? My advice true, forget this. The legend of Artorius art none but a fabrication. Traversing the dark, hmm. tis but a fairy tale. Have thy own respect. Go not yonder knocking for nothing, I say. Nevertheless, I feel I like how she makes people. cat noises while she talks. Arena of the Dark Root Wood. I command a clan of hunters who track down defiles of the forest graves. What dost thou say? Wilt thou not join us? Oh, yes, I believe we would suit thee well. Oh, sure. I am there. And now. The... Oh. Sure. We are now part of their covenant. Nice. Just I because like it... when she did. And here, take it this way. You like what? No, what were you gonna say first? Oh, um, I was gonna say the only reason why I'm abandoning the uh, the covenant I was part of first is that this one on. Okay, so it's very clear that the servers here are dead, right? But just in case. I'd rather not have to deal with one of the more, uh, zone-based PvP covenants. Mm. 
So by joining them, we don't get invaded, ever. Uh... It's a safety thing. Anyhow, so you were saying, Mel? Um, oh, yeah. Um, sorry. Um, I like when she talks because it looks like she's trying very desperately to eat a spoonful of peanut butter. <laughs> you know, fair. <laughs> so, I don't know if you've been hearing me every so often get picked up by my mic. I've just been going, oh, oh, oh. Oh, was, oh was that you? I thought that was her. No, that was me. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh no, Lucy! How did we lose Lucy? Uh, hello. Did something happen? A little bit. I what happened? I swear there's a bonfire around here. Oh well, even if there isn't. Um So, Lucy, I'm no. glad you're back because uh wait, is she not back? No, I don't think. Okay. We're going to be uh encountering a a boss. A very familiar boss. Is it my grandma? No. <laughs> so, this is the, uh, I'm gonna actually switch shields, because, uh, for now at least we won't need, um, the magic res. Magic. Um, and I'm also gonna switch rings in that case, I'm gonna go to a physical ring. So, this is the grave site of Artorias. Hmm. Now, uh, everything I've done is going to have affected a specific cutscene that will play. I love your character's sassy walk. It's pretty great, isn't it? <laughs> so, uh, I'll, I'm gonna ask that everyone be quiet for this bit. for the saddest boss fight in the game. His pupper! No! No, don't fight the pupper! Leave the dog alone. Hey, Gremlin. Hey, so, you yeah. guys have actually met this dog before. Yeah, I remember. I remember. And the dog. thing is, is that that opening cutscene changes if you save, uh, save Sif from, uh, from the abyss. Oh. So, what happened? she recognized us. She's oh. sad about having to fight us. No. No, no, no! Stop running to cover. I take no pleasure in this fight, but I did think that you guys would like that little detail. I mean, I mean, you can see what I'm saying in the chat. I am here. Oh, okay. Dog, big dog, friend, dog friend, no friend. What gets even more depressing is that the lower health she gets, she'll start limping. No! Okay, I'm just gonna not... It's gonna not work. You tell me when you're done. Man. People are all upset about Pokemon Sword and Shield's graphics and shit, but I don't know. See? The Legendary looks pretty good. I feel st <laughs> Jesus Christ. I feel so bad about this! 
But this is... Die. You know what the unfortunate part is? Is that this is mandatory. You can't skip this fight. Oh. Well then I guess I just stopped playing the game. I'm good. I don't... I don't need this. Victory? Is it really a victory? No. Not no. in the slightest. It's not. But unfortunately... Her sacrifice will not be in vain. Who that? What is this? That's the hornet, hornet ring. So remember that woman who uh, we gave Artorius' soul to? Mm -hmm. That that's her ring. It's thought that the uh, essentially all the all the swords fallen soldiers. Yeah. Here, well, at least we'll pay our respects at the very least. Yeah. On. Um, yeah. Let's see. I want the dog back. They were so big. Big bubble. Please prayer. And pay our respects to uh to Sif and to Artorius and the rest of those uh val to those uh valiant knights. They were such a big puppo. Yeah. yeah. The goodest girl. Best girl. In the the arms girl. Angels starts playing. Now, we will end up, uh, we are going to go ahead and, uh, get a head start on our next, uh, and final area before final boss. But the fact that that yeah. seemed like an easy fight, though, I hate it. It's because we weren't meant oh, to come man. here at this level. Or this, or rather, we're a little ways above the level that we were supposed to be. But you, I don't think you were here uh -huh. for the fight before that, in which I just completely... Yeah. <laughs> I, I hit the boss five times, and it, it died. Ooh. Oh. Yeah. I think Rabbit, I missed that episode. Like... No, oh, it, it, it was this happened. episode. It just happened. Yeah. Oh. I must have missed that part then, because I was making yeah. brownies and cleaning up the kitchen. Um, yeah. here. Awesome, break quarantine and come get some. <laughs> My god. Don't encourage, don't encourage breaking quarantine in this day and age. No. It's just between friends. <laughs> Besides, I know you won't actually come here to get brownies. Well, it depends. Do they have nuts in them? No. Yeah, okay, I'm not going. Oh, you like them with... You like them with <laughs> actually, nuts? wait, no. no, I should go because they have no nuts, damn it! I played myself! <laughs> <laughs> now, normally, if I was playing this as a serious thing, I would also go and kill another specific NPC to get another Firekeeper soul to buff up our our uh, flask even more. I already feel bad about some of the stuff that I'm doing. Like, yeah. uh, I don't know if Mel, you're aware, uh, we killed Amazing Chest. Okay, the reason the being... The soft you monster. The reason being is that uh, I just wanted to kill Gwendolyn, and uh, the only other way to kill him would have been to do this whole uh, side questy thing off in the, uh, the Tomb of Giants, and I didn't want to spend all my time in the dark. You know, that's fair. I hate the dark. So, uh... Normally I... Go normally I... You. Normally I don't kill her, Sorry. but uh... Yeah. Basically, the Tomb of the Giants is not a place you want to be in for longer than you have to. Yeah, Lucy could yeah. not handle Nito all that well. I nope. had a hard time with that one. Handle who? Uh, um, Brave Lord Nito. I don't think I was there for that. You were not. It was just, uh, it was just me that time. Uh, I hated it. He has a uh, attack that he uses that is uh, signaled with a very loud, piercing screech, oh, or like a bro. horror movie I scream, and uh, yeah, it was getting to Lucy. I hate it. So, I hate it. Generally speaking, this area sucks. Now I know I said that about a lot of areas, but hear me out. This area sucks I mean, in particular. I think that can apply to all of Dark Souls. At this, that this area sucks in particular because of transient curse. There are ghosts all over this map. We cannot kill them unless we have transient curse activated. Um, 
and they will just come up through walls and shit, so. Oh god. Yeah, I've only got two. I do not remember where the life of me, I where I get more. Um, let's go. Okay, um... <clears throat> Uh, we just hit time. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Um, in that case, I'm gonna do a quick quit it out, and, uh, we'll see you all next episode, then. Till then, goodbye! Bye! Bye! Bye.